Hi, my name is Redmond Burke. I'm the Chief of Pediatric Cardiac Surgery here at Nicholas Children's Hospital. And our goal here is to take care of every child over their lifetime in the least traumatic way possible. And that requires not just gifted doctors and nurses, it requires technology. And we found about 13 years ago that looking at x-rays and CT scans was helpful, but it didn't really replicate what we need to be able to do in an operating room. My partner and colleague, uh, Bob Hannon, and I were thinking about ways to improve our technical ability. How do we anticipate what's gonna happen in an operation and, and be able to deal with it? And the technology of 3D printing was evolving at just that time. And so we started reaching out and seeing, well, how do you get a three-dimensional model? And we found a company, Stratasys, who was also looking for ways to use 3D imaging in unique ways. So that collaboration turned into a very powerful um, way for us to guide the technology into our domain so that we could help each other. And, and because of that, we've been able to create thousands of heart and lung models, basically any kind of model you could imagine. And the other physicians in our hospital come up to us, the plastic surgeons, the dental surgeons, the orthopedic surgeons, and say, how do we get this technology for our patients? And so we've been able to spin that initial kernel of an idea about the heart into every aspect of medicine. We've taken care of babies who were told, moms and dads who were told by physicians that their baby was inoperable because nobody could actually picture how to do an operation that would save that child. And we saw one of those babies. The family got on the internet when they were told that their baby was inoperable because she had half a heart and one lung. And they started searching for somebody who would operate on an inoperable baby and they found us and then it becomes our responsibility to use technology in a way that we can make that miracle happen for them. So we did that. We made, this is actually a model of that child's heart when she was a newborn baby with half a heart, one lung, and a very complex anatomic problem. So using three-dimensional imaging, we were able to create a model that allowed us to plan a successful operation. So if I can plan an operation with a three-dimensional model, I can do it gently and accurately, and, and then I know I'm meeting my goal of reducing this child's lifetime trauma uh, by doing a good operation. That's invaluable. You can't really put a, a price on that. That's, uh, that's why I do this, and that's why we use technology like 3D imaging. Uh, to enhance care because those moments are, are a treasure.